What's good everyone, Smiling Grove here, playing Need for Speed Heat. It's my first go at it, so we'll see what happens. I do want to say that I am playing this game on a wheel and pedal set. It's a very, very different feeling playing on a wheel and pedal set. I have played Need for Speed my whole entire life. I love the games, they're a lot of fun. They are not sim racers. They're not even simcades. They are strictly arcade racers. And playing this game on a wheel and pedal set is not the most difficult thing, but it's certainly a lot easier on a controller. However, I did dial in the settings on the game. Uh, if you want to see what my settings that I'm using are, uh, just uh, comment below and I'll share that with you. But I did dial in the settings in the game and it feels somewhat natural. It certainly um, took a while to get it where I could even keep the car from doing... Well, as you can see there, I tried to brake going into a corner and the car just didn't want to brake really. So, yeah, it's, it's very different playing with a wheel and pedal set. However, the game is fantastic. Uh, the graphics are pretty pretty darn good and the sounds are, are pretty good um, but it's a little odd so I'm playing with a Thrustmaster T300 RS and I'll put a link to that in the description below but for the first time that I've had oh what just well, hopefully I have enough pace between me and the other person to still finish first. And I do, thankfully. Okay. okay now you should really think about getting off the street. Remember I painted you those So playing the with the wheel and pedal set on this game, it's pretty fun. Um, there's my beautiful BMW M3. But yeah, it's fun. And you'll see here through a couple races, you know, not the most accurate but you know you work with what you have but the game is fun And you'll see throughout this video that I start to get a better hang of the handling feel of the car with uh, using the steering wheel. I learn how to drift a little bit better. It's definitely a pretty good learning curve trying to play this game on the wheel. But I'm enjoying it very much. The braking is a little odd. You're almost better off just... Oh, how about that near miss? You're almost better off just letting off the throttle and, you know, taking the corner. Uh, I brake slightly here and there, just like taps of the brake. But the car doesn't really do a whole lot. It doesn't really respond that much to the braking. However, if you use the handbrake, Oh, another near miss. If you use the handbrake, the car just it just stops. It, it's really, really crazy. I don't know if there's any handbrake clips in this video, but I'm sure there'll be some at some point. I don't really like to use it for... Well, that's a massive accident. All right, I, my first chase 
By the way, I do not condone uh, any type of illegal activity in a vehicle or any illegal activity. This is a video game, and if I cannot run the cops in a video game, great. In real life, pull over. I was trying to see if that was going to react like the old Need for Speed games where you can like knock the uh, gas station, basically you knock the roof down on top of the police car to stop the chase. I think that was in Most Wanted. Ah uh, man, I can't really recall off the top of my head, but I remember that specifically you could do that. You could drive to a gas station and then it would basically fall down on the officers and it would help. You know, you evade. And we escape. Not bad for a first night. You got plenty more. Alright, so that was my first night in the game. And just getting used to the game. But I'm really enjoying it. It's a lot of fun. And maybe I'll transition over to a controller. But honestly, I'm getting a hang of it, so it's not that bad. I'd rather just use my wheel and pedal set. That's why I bought it. Speaking of wheel and pedal set, force feedback. And like I said, I'll tell you my settings. If you want to know, just comment and I'll, I'll let you know what the settings I'm using in the game. But don't think of this as a, a Gran Turismo sport. I don't I mean obviously it's not it's need for speed but the physics are nowhere near any of your sims so just have fun with the game enjoy playing the game that's what I'm gonna do I'm just gonna have fun with it and you know I'll leave the real racing to real racing games Frostbite engine is really awesome. I don't know if you've noticed, but I did make a slight adjustment to the exhaust, so get a lot more of those beautiful downshift crackles and pops that I love, that I hope you love too, because it's awesome. Um, John Cooper Mini. But yeah, you just saw how long that breaking zone took. I mean, it's pretty ridiculous. That's why I just kind of lift off the throttle and, you know, tap the brakes here and there if I need to get grip essentially because the brakes don't really do a whole lot dexterity check hey dex good to see you again i'll show you the way to the track follow me Huh? Ah, Alright, so we're gonna follow this guy now to first daytime setup that I've had. Throw a right. We grew up on these roads. Me and Lucas are the same age. Though obviously the years have been harder on his Cupid ass. This track where we're going? That's where we learned to race back in the day. Think it's some kind of water treatment plant. The place used to stink like a swamp, and that's what made it perfect. The air was nasty, but the roads were clear. One time, Lucas nearly drifted into an open tank of sewage. But don't worry, they put a roof on that since. Let's 
sessions for out of towners. So y'all don't embarrass yourselves at the showdown. If you impress, maybe I'll give you a little something something to get your car off the showdown standards. I like the sound of that. Alright, here we go. First daytime race. Let's uh, see what happens. Noob around. I love that. It's a great name. Does anyone still use the word noob? I mean, especially in gaming, we always used to use that word. But since I've transitioned more towards racing rather than, you know, your FPS and stuff like that, I haven't heard noob that much. So I'm just wondering, comment below if you still use the word new. That's in the video. Unfortunately, my laptop was dying. Alright, so it looks like we're going to win this first daytime race. And I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, short video. This is my first time playing Need for Speed Heat. I really enjoy it, and I'll keep making more content. Be sure to like and subscribe. Until next time, stay smiling.